are steam bent drum shells under constant stress and or tension. Micah here with Cask and SteamBandDrum.com. I was just reading up on the forums and there's plenty of mention out there that steam bent drum shells are under stress, they're under tension, that's why they sound the way that they do, that's why they resonate the way that they do. So today we're either going to prove or disprove this. Check it out. We're going to see how much tension the shell's under. Doesn't look like much. Don't try cutting a drum like that at home, but that shell is under absolutely zero stress, zero tension. And I'm not saying that some steam bent drum shells might be under tension. If you don't cure these properly, as a matter of fact, they probably will be under tension for a long time. But what Google's AI states that over time, they can develop spring back is totally false. Over time, there's just gonna be less and less spring back. Um, as the wood is formed into a circle, the longer it sits and dries, the more uniform of a circle it's gonna stay in. So I just wanted to bust that myth. Uh, if you're on the forums and somebody tells you that steam bent drum shells are constantly under stress, constantly under tension, I mean, you can direct them to this video if you want. Uh, I'm not saying, all steam bent shells are built like this, but the ones I build are not under stress and not under tension. So thanks for checking it out, guys. Don't use the table saw like I did.